You guys will not believe what happened to me today. It was insane. But first, I have a couple updates for you. A lot of you have been asking about the cats, so I just wanted to give you a quick update. There's Boo Boo and there's Nyla. And Nyla just had a birthday. She is five years old. Oh, what are you doing, honey? She thinks because she's five years old, she's allowed to just sit on the table like that. Second thing is, I am probably going to LA this week. I'll tell you more about that later. Another thing is, I have been playing this game on my phone for a while now. It's called Best Fiends. It's an app. And recently they approached me and asked me if I'd be interested in doing a sponsorship for their new game called Best Fiends Forever. And I was like, are you serious? Like, you guys want me to do it? I, like, I was really excited about it. So I played the game, I really liked it, and it's almost the same kind of concept because it's the same characters, the same storyline, but it's a totally different game. So I really would like to share it with you guys. Nyla! Let's go get my phone. I found my phone. Actually, I need to switch hands so that I can show you properly because I can't play the game with my left hand. I have to play with my right hand. So, basically, you just have to tap this guy, the black slugs. You have to keep ta attacking them and you use your fiends down here to help you. Once they're like leveled up and they're charged, you can basically use their powers to help you. Like that one just shot a fireball and you keep tapping them. <laughs> It's really fun, and it's so addicting. And every time you're slapping the slugs, you're basically collecting coins, which help you move along faster and farther in the game. I keep collecting coins, and you know what? It's actually, look at my arm. It, look at this, I don't know if you can see my muscle. It feels like a workout in my arm as I'm playing it. So I am on level 40. I try to beat my score. I put a link in the description for you guys to download the game for free. Now, I hope you enjoy the rest of the vlog. What up, peeps? Guess what I'm doing today. I'm on my way to go meet up with Nick number one and Nick number two to go rooftoping again. So it'll be my second time going and I'm really excited. So we're gonna be going on top of a hotel. I just met up with them. What did you just say to me? The roof door is usually unlocked and the security guard is usually not at his station guarding that door. So we're gonna try and take advantage of that. <laughs> we are approaching the building. We have to just act like we belong there. So we had to wait for someone to scan their like card. It's funny how how we know now. <laughs> Wrong entrance. Roof access. Bingo. supposed to be here. Oh, they always have a ladder for us too. Well, well, we made it all the way up. This is an incredible view of the city. It's like 360, I can see everything. These are two of my favorite buildings and City Hall, my favorite building. And there's a crane. Nick told me he climbed that crane last week. Isn't he crazy? So far down. I have to sit right here, risk my life, and get some dope photos. Look how high this is. It's really high. crazy photo, but I'm kind of going to have to hang a little bit. Actually, I I'm gonna try and hang a little lower so my 
arms extended for me. I'm fooling you guys! <laughs> okay. Okay. I'll show you how it's safe in a minute. Apologize 100%. I know that was probably so scary for you to see me almost falling, but it was safe because, well, it's not 100% safe, but I'm very strong and I felt confident doing it. But there's these poles here that I was standing on the whole entire time, so I'm good. And I have this here too, and they wouldn't let me fall, so don't worry. <laughs> there's different towers, but is this one the South Tower? Yeah, Alright, I'm gonna ask you the dumbest question. Like, what? I'm so bad. Like, how do you know this is south and that one's the north? There's a sense of direction. That's east because that's the river. Okay. And once you know where east is, <laughs> you can figure out that's north. Okay, because that's like north There's East temple, Philly. That's north I get Philly. it. And then this is south Philly. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Alright, I understand. Look at this guy. He literally just walked across that beam. I mean, I guess I would do it too. <laughs> do, 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 do. Boom, damn. Going up to the North Tower now. Ooh, look how pretty this is. Oh my god. The security guard's up here. You just saw him? Only one of you go. Get him, get back. There's nowhere for us to hide either. We're like stuck up here. We think the guy is going. Oh, he's there. He's back. Oh my god, I was just saying. Alright, guys. I'm not gonna look, but I want you to tell me what you see. No, I'm pointing it the right way. Did you see anything? Oh my god. So if I just watched the video and I could see him walking over here. He was, he was like in the bottom of the video. Alright, we don't see him anymore. This is like where the thrill comes in of rooftopping. Myth number one is gonna go down first and give us a heads up if it's okay to go. It's not really that bad what we're doing, to be honest with you, but who knows? <laughs> oh my god, he keeps. I was literally. We were gonna go again. What is this guy doing? I think he's probably taking a break like he doesn't wanna do work. He's probably just chilling. The struggle of a vlogger is I really wanna be able to film everything the whole way out. And at the same time, I'm like, oh, do I film everything? Or do I like be precautionary and put the SD card away in case something happens and they try to take it from me and I don't get any of my footage? Then I would be so mad. And then you guys would be like, wait, I think I heard something. Did you hear him? Uh oh. He's talking to me personally right now. Uh oh. I hope it's all good. I don't know what to do. This is such a dilemma. We're stuck on my so I just received a text from Nick and he said just come down and act casual. He's cool. All right, good. Just wondering what's up. All right, cool. Thank God. I had a feeling he would be cool because he's a Philly dude. Yeah. He's like, calm down. He's right over there. I'm taking the SD card out right now. Just to be safe. Telling this guy that other kids are doing this too, going around, saying, so "Let them know." Yeah, yeah. they want to find other places. I'm sure you guys, I mean, cops and security know that. Oh no. All right, peeps. Well, that was an experience. We just got caught up on the roof. The security from the hotel came up. They called the cops, the cops showed up. I couldn't film any of this, just like teeny little bits I tried to get for you. They gave us each a citation, they have a court date. It sucks, but it was still a fun experience either way. And don't be mad at these guys, totally not their fault. I wouldn't suggest that any of you do it. I just do this sometimes because it's like fun and thrilling for me. And I always wanted to go Rooftopping. Yeah. What you gotta deal with sometimes. It's the other side of the game. Well, that was a fun experience. The guys are leaving. Peace. Thank you. Until next time. Alright, bye.
know what happened now that I'm thinking about it that was really weird? The cop took a photo with his cell phone of all of our IDs. Like, that's not professional. That's really weird. I wonder why he did that. Oh my god. Damn, this is a bug. Is that a bug, boo boo? This is so embarrassing. It looks like I have a huge pimple on my nose now because I hit my face on the ladder when I was going up. I hope you enjoyed the whole vlog. I'll see you guys soon. Peace on the streets, son. I'm an ex-con. A lot of people don't know that. I went to jail for two oh, weeks for uh, for armed robbery. Uh, oh, back. was that the prank academy robbery? <laughs> that you were in? Right. 